doing content on nine to five days is really hard. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, girl, be still now. You, you, you are beautiful. <laughs> Yeah, I'm making a mess already. Hey y'all, what's up? It's the end of the day and we're about to do a very quick makeup look. Um, y'all, I have been re relaxing and resting, but it is 7.50. And I have to shoot a video for a company that I'm working with in a collaboration. So, it should take me no more than 30 to 40 minutes to record the video. So, I'm about to go ahead and knock it out before the night ends. I do have a YouTube video ready to go for tomorrow. I just need to upload it. I just need to upload it. Yeah, so I just need to... um. Get it downloaded from CapCut and upload it to YouTube. Make my thumbnail and stuff. And that's all stuff that I could do early in the morning before I go to work. Yeah, just wanted to check in with y'all. Let y'all know what I'm doing. I am using one of my samples from Sephora. I'm going to try the Estee Lauder sample today. And see how she does and how she looks on camera. Y'all, this is the thing like about foundation and stuff. I really hate that I don't have like my perfect match. And you know, there's no such thing as a perfect match for everybody. But I'm just mad that I don't have like my signature one. Because like getting behind softbox lights, ring lights and stuff like that, it shows literally every imperfection. Right now I am putting on Estee Lauder Double Wear. This is a matte foundation because I do get oily. So I'm just sweeping it on my face right now, y'all. Let's speed it up, baby. Okay, y'all, so we have the final look. We got the hair on. I had to clear off some memory um, just so I can show y'all some behind the scenes. But this is what my background is going to be. Um, so in the brief, they wanted a background that was not distracting. So I was like, I recorded in my living room with my art twice, actually three or four times. <laughs> and I don't want that in my background for this particular video because the focus should be my glasses. So yeah, that's why we are here. So it's gonna be challenging trying to make sure that I am centered in between these two pieces, but we're gonna get it together. Let me show y'all the rest of the filming setup. I need to catch my breath. <laughs> Cause I've been scrambling y'all, it's 10 o'clock and we're just getting started. But anyway, before I show y'all the filming setup, I just wanna say that I do like how everything came together as far as my makeup and hair is concerned. Um, Y'all know I'm a real big critic about my makeup, but this Estee Lauder foundation looks really, really good. Um, of course, I didn't take my time because I feel like for my chit chat video, my Amazon video, face was beat. Face was giving, okay? I don't know how I did it, honestly. I did take my time, so I guess that's how I did it. But I don't think this look is bad at all. I think it's really freaking pretty, but... Anyway, enough chatting, y'all. I don't have much time to waste. I do have to work tomorrow. Um, also, I'm thinking about taking off my wide angle lens because Zelo does want this video to be um, like pretty close up. So, yeah. So, on to the setup. As y'all can see, the ring light is over in this corner. I got the tripod right here. I have my computer with my script right in front of me and then beside me I have uh, the box and some glasses that I already have from Zelo. 
but yeah y'all that's pretty much what the setup looks like um i know y'all i know y'all might be like girl you got a script yes because i knew i'm trying to hurry up and, and that's not what we need to be doing is stuttering yes i do have a script because i don't want to take forever with this video i think for my amazon video my chit chat it took me about 30 or 40 minutes to film um so that's what i want to give today and i want to just say whatever is on my script add a little bit take a little bit away and move like that so we are about to switch memory cards and then get right into it all right y'all so we are officially done i i was reviewing some of the content um after i recorded each clip so i'm pretty sure i'll be able to make something work um and that's not to say the video is horrible but it is 11 o'clock and i don't know i don't know where i get my energy from y'all god okay so we're cleaning up y'all I really love these glasses. I'm pretty sure the Zillow video will be up before this video. So, if you haven't seen it already, girl, go watch it. Get you some frames. If you wear glasses, even if you don't wear glasses, get you some blue light blockers, which is what y'all see me wearing all the time. These are the ones that have been in my vlogs ever since I started vlogging. And I love them. I love them. Especially if you are a YouTuber, if you record videos, edit videos, and you're looking at your computer screen every day, you need blue light blockers, period. So, these are my faves. I have a, a new fave, but you gotta watch the other video to find out what the new fave is. So it took me about 40 minutes to record the video, which is what I would, which I, which is what I was originally thinking. It would take me the script was really helpful i didn't have to think for real i just had to say whatever was on my script because i wrote it earlier um and honestly y'all if i would have not taken a nap i would have been done with this by nine o'clock like if i would have started recording at eight i would have been done by nine but keep in mind like i took a nap got up at 6 40 talked on the phone eight did my makeup or did my makeup then eight so you know doing content on nine to five days is really hard but i think i did the same thing with my good american um so i just gotta try to um uh, start back doing my content on the weekends where i have a complete off day that way i don't have to rush through it even though like I, I don't want to even use the term rush because i feel like i didn't really rush through it because it was no reason for me to rush i had my script but if i could take my time a little bit more like with my makeup i would like that but this estee lauder is like the perfect match y'all for me like this looks really subtle really skin like it has a skin like finish and i like that but sometimes i do be wanting it to look like i have on makeup i told a girl that's a four day and she was like most people want a skin like finish and that is true i feel like you need a foundation that's like skin like but when you want to go out and about and you want to be looking like it i want to look like i have on makeup you know and this is cute this is like super cute for work and stuff when i did my makeup in august i'm gonna pop up a picture right here like girl that was giving like i got my face done by somebody that was Too faced so i think i might be going with Too faced y'all mm, no but we're wasting time i still need to shower and get the vlog uploaded it's already edited i just gotta upload it to youtube it's a short one y'all it's only 15 minutes so let's clean up y'all i'll come back to end the vlog later rocco then came his little butt up in here with me but he want to also be out there with mine he likes to be in both places at the same time so he want to put half his body in the bathroom with me and the other half his body in the bedroom but I have life work. Go outside. 
I guess you don't want to go. <sighs> okay, y'all. Final review. Final thoughts on this Estelada. She's a cute, mild beat. I like it. She might be a contender for some events. But y'all, we're about to wipe out this face. Double cleanse this face. And go to bed. We have to go to Target tomorrow. And finish some reports. Trying to get ahead of my reports since I am trying to do a bootleg version of Vlogtober. I'm thinking about just uploading every day throughout the week. And just not doing the weekends. You know, I feel like that's more realistic for me by being my first time. And I'm still behind on content. So, I feel like that's probably going to be my best bet until I figure out a new routine. Because I told y'all, I'm wearing a lot of new hats now, y'all. So, I have to restructure my schedule. I've been thinking about getting back up at like 5.30, 6 in the morning and working out for an hour and then doing work-related stuff before work. And then my 5 to 9 life can be dedicated to my creator journey. So, yeah, I'm just really exploring all options right now. And that's just going to be it, y'all. I am going to finish listening to my video that I want to go up on Wednesday so I can know just how much editing I need to do, what I need to cut out and stuff like that. What I, what I wish Cap could have had was a marker symbol so like while I'm listening I can just go put a little mark on what I need to edit. Our movie has that and that was so helpful for me. But... I could think I ain't got there. Like, I don't think I could do to let me know that I need to go change something. It's probably add a sticker there or something. I don't know. But anyway, y'all, we're going to end the vlog here because this is the girl about to double cleanse, get in the shower, and go to bed. It's 12 30. I honestly thought I would <laughs> still be doing house related stuff. Right now, which I'm just unwinding down right now. Y'all won't see me until after work. So I will see y'all in tomorrow's video. Bye. Hi guys. Hi girls. Happy Blocktober. Today is Wednesday and we are starting this vlog super late. If you don't know, I do work a 9 to 5. So I had to work today and then I have to and then I had an after work eyelash appointment so your girl is coming on the vlog with a full fresh set of lashes and I am loving them okay um, so right across the street from my lash bar is Trader Joe's today we are having a girls day with my girls and I was trying to find a way to make it like fall themed but I didn't have real I didn't really have time to go on Pinterest and see like what are some fall things that I could possibly bring. Oh no, my phone is losing service over here. So I didn't really have time to uh look that up. It's been a busy week, y'all. I don't even have on earrings. I just noticed that. But um yeah, so I didn't have time to look up some fall things. So I'm just about to get them some flowers. I think I have some thank you cards at home. If I have time, I will write a sweet note in them. But as for now, I'm just going to bring the flowers and gift each girl a flower. Because why not give people their flowers while they're here? As I was getting my lashes done, I already was thinking of topics that we could discuss. Um, just like mental health check-ins and stuff. Since yesterday was mental health day. So yeah. We're about to go on TJ's, y'all. It's going to be a quick in and out trip. I have one notch on my battery, and we got to go and do a quick face and find something to put on. So, yeah, let's go inside a TJ's. I bet y'all be like, this girl be 
talking with our hands yes y'all i cannot help it i've been doing it all my life so let's get in tj's all right y'all we are back in the car i got what's she taking pictures of baby people tag and stuff I got four of these room sprays. These are lemon myrtle and spearmint oils. And if I have time to write on the cards, I'll write something like, you know, whenever you're having a, a rough day or a bad day, just spray this around your work desk. If you work from home, spray this in your room. If y'all didn't know, lemon is a scent that uplifts you. So that's why I got that. And then I also got purple flowers. So the restaurant that we're going to today is a purple inspired restaurant. It's, it has like purple decor everywhere. So I'm going to give each girl one or two roses. I think I have enough to give each girl two roses. Just to give them their flowers while they're here. And now y'all, we are about to head home. Ooh. I got time to do a, a 30 minute beat. And today we are going to be trying the, um, what is the name of the foundation? We're going to be trying the Too Faced foundation that we've tried before, just in a different shade. So we're going to see how that looks today. And I will come back to y'all, I think once we're getting ready, or maybe after we're ready, I'm not too sure. We'll talk about it once we get there. So yeah, I'll see y'all in a little bit. I want to do a quick chat as I'm getting ready. I was just going to come out here and show y'all what I look like after, but we're not doing too much recording during Vlogtober, so I need to try to get as much footage as possible. And then also, I just want to talk about these things. So, um, as I told y'all earlier, we are about to go to a girls' day out, girls' night out with my girlies, my happy hour honeys. We try to meet up once a month, you know, just to catch up, try new places in Houston and have some drinks and have some girl time, y'all. So I'm so different from the girls. And what I mean when I say that is I don't be prepared when it's uh, when it's time to order my food. Like I never know what I want. And y'all, it's so crazy because I eat the same things like salmon, mashed potatoes, asparagus or spinach it's always salmon no matter where i go i don't even know if this place has salmon and i'm the host of this month's girls uh, i was about to say girls trip but girls night out i'm the host and i don't even know what type of food the place has i feel like i looked at tiktok i saw a couple of uh, videos on tiktok and a lot of people were saying that they had a great time there so i was like okay cool this is where we're gonna go hopefully the food is good this is literally a blind choice. I gave the girls two choices between Friends Houston and this new place called the Chelsea. And everybody chose Friends because like I said, it's a it's an aesthetically pleasing place. And it's the it's the hype right now. So everybody pretty much was like, yeah, let's go to Friends. So that's why I was like, okay, let me book the reservation. But girl, my friends, they've been thinking about outfits since Monday. They've been thinking about what they was going to eat since Monday as well. Here I am, the day of the event. And I don't know what I'm going to eat. My outfit is not all the way planned out. But I'm about to spend about 10 more minutes on my face, get dressed, and leave. Because I want to be the first one there. So I can set out their roses and stuff but are y'all like that like if y'all are planning a day with your friends or your boo do y'all already like map out everything as far as like you already know what you're gonna eat you already look at the menu and stuff like that i don't think i've ever been that type of person unless i'm going to a restaurant where they have like a, a set menu that you have to choose from like not that many choices because when it's not a lot of choices i'd be like why are we going here? <laughs> but as long as they have a variety of choices, I can always find something to eat. 
but anyway comment down below and let me know if y'all are like that i'm gonna go ahead and hurry up and finish getting ready and i'll come back to y'all once we are fully dressed okay we're back we're ready i have on the Too faced mocha i think and i think she's a perfect match y'all i didn't do too much i didn't go too heavy i'll show y'all my outfit in a little bit i just want to show y'all my face my regular jewelry mine did not put my little van cleef dupe on tight enough and i ain't even got time so i'm gonna have to let one of the girls do it at the restaurant that is a tj maxx special y'all so check out your local tj's for the van cleef dupes my scent of the night is my current obsession which is rihanna's fenty perfume my purse is packed i'm ready i want to get there at least 10 minutes early so let's go y'all okay y'all so since it is a wednesday i did not want to wear heels so i'm wearing my tory birch oh girl be still now i'm wearing my tory birch sandals these jeans that y'all see me wear a thousand times over and over. <laughs> um, this shirt is like two years old. I wore it to a wedding and haven't worn it again until today. So I just threw that on. I don't have on any earrings. So I'm going to have to make sure my hair covers that up. But yeah, this is what I'm wearing. Cute, comfy. And not too casual, but casual. We have arrived, y'all. There's the girls. <laughs> gift which was flowers in the little room spray and y'all i was able to make a little card on canva i'm gonna put it on the screen for y'all so y'all can see what it's looking like um it was just real it was a real good moment i needed this girls night with my girls so now we're trying to plan what we're gonna do in november and we actually talked about friends miss too it was a good time y'all so if you haven't planned anything with your girls in a long time, just plan a little girls night out or even a girls night in because sometimes you just need a girls day, like a true girls day, girl chatting, talking about things you can't talk about with your boo. Keisha got these red lights on me, girl. It look like red light special. Yeah, yeah. Insert song, insert the red light special song right here. Cause that's what it's giving. Um, but I didn't get much footage in there, y'all, because like I said, we was girl chatting. I did get a little bit of B-roll of um, the restaurant, but not much because I just ain't been recording for real, for real. But yeah, y'all. I'm about to call Myron and see if he wants something to eat. Because we really only ate appetizers there. We really didn't even get a meal. The appetizers by themselves was delicious. So, yeah. I want to listen to some music, y'all. Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday. It has been a while since I checked in with y'all. I think the last time I checked in with y'all was Wednesday. And today is Sunday. Today is October 15th. So, um, just to bring y'all up to speed a little bit, I have been working, y'all. 
things had got hectic for a little while because I had so many evaluations and meetings popping up at once so I'm not all the way caught up but I'm in a good position now that hopefully I can keep picking up the camera but y'all so this weekend which was Friday was my um, high school homecoming we were originally supposed to come down for that but some things changed we decided not to come and then ultimately we ended up leaving and coming to my hometown um, but I miss everything homecoming related um, Myra had to go attend a funeral so I really just been chilling hanging out with the family um, spending time with my niece and everybody else so yeah I haven't been doing much of nothing but right now we are headed to brunch with the fam I have taken y'all to the cafe before um, so that's where we're going today we are going to the cafe we're at the cafe y'all is this the door yeah, we are at, here's the fam. My mom is a hater. Jay. And then there's a little baby. Hi, mom. Girl, sit down. She got right back out. Yeah, Alright y'all, we are leaving the cafe. Look at Papa with his grandbaby. <laughs> Say hey, Vlad. <laughs> How old are you, Mommy? One. <laughs> We leaving the cafe, y'all. I think my mom about to, my mom and dad about to take me to Walmart. Jesus, what in the world? Hi. Hi. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Hi. Ooh. 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 All right, y'all. Gonna be our school doing nothing anyway. They gave me a strawberry margarita, came in Jack. Hey. <laughs> Have y'all ever had one of these before? Yeah. This is my first time having a strawberry kind. Girl, so let's taste it. Let's open. I like it. I don't like it. Y'all like no. it? What is that? This it's is Cayman. This smells sweet. Mm -hmm. It looks disgusting. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not bad. This is the one that they gave me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mo, 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 mo. It's sweet. It's sweet. Yeah. I got it. No, ma'am. <laughs> we are at the bluff with my little family, you guys. We finally got Rocco chain big. It's a big family. We gotta put the bead on the bead. You hear me? It's a little family for now. Uh, it's, a big family. it's only us three. He, he want us to be a big family so bad, y'all. It. It's kind of cool out here. It don't be this cool in Houston. The temperature right now is like 70 something. But the wind is blowing. Girl. And all I got on is this little jacket with a crop top and some workout pants. Let's see, what is the temp? 65 actually, with the wind blowing. And the Mississippi River, river, the Mississippi River behind us. I always love coming home to see this view, y'all. It's so beautiful down here. <laughs> Let me get away from you, y'all. I don't know what they're doing. They're probably about to do a balloon release over here. I don't know if y'all can see them over there with the, those balloons. But when I was living here, y'all, this is where I used to come and walk to exercise. A lot of people come down here and walk. So we can walk here. We can walk all the way down there. And then, hold on, let me make sure my camera's screwed on tight. But you end up down here. It's a, it's a really long way to walk. 
I think it end up being like, you can end up walking five miles out here. And that's if you do the whole thing, go all the way around at least four or five times. You could do like five miles and you get to see beautiful scenery. I love it. I always come here where we always come here when we are home just to walk. It's very nostalgic and they got some locks down there. I would take y'all down there and show y'all, but we waiting on our food to get ready. And I'm pretty sure Rocco is not gonna wanna walk down there. Let's go see. Let's go see. He wanna walk down by the locks. This way. All right, guys, we are gonna go. You got that view? <laughs> they talking about my boy. So, so we got cheer. No. <laughs> no, man. He's he, he so friendly. If you you sit down right now, I let him go. He's going to come sit in your lap. Because he thinks he's a child. Is, That's all he wants. Okay, okay. okay. So we'll see. What's his name? Rocco. Hey. Rocco. Hi, Rocco. 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 Hey! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Beautiful. Come on. He's not gonna do anything. Hey, yeah, look at he it. might lay down on you and let you, you, you rub you, his you, belly. You, you are beautiful. Sure you, oh my Thank God. You. Yes, <laughs> Yeah, they took the locks off the bridge. I don't see them anymore. They will be normally here. See how people got they Relationship with Leslie and Kaylani, D and D. They used to have locks right here, but they took them off. It's colder right here, though. Yeah, because we're getting closer to the water. Headed okay, back to the car, you guys. Ooh, it's cold. Y'all see my hair blowing in the wind? It's really feeling like fall in Mississippi, y'all. I can't believe it. Yeah, I'm getting some good vitamin D. The sun is setting. It just feels so good. This was a good trip home. A good last minute trip home. 